start. Second ice bath. It's very strange feeling the sun on my face and my body just spazzing out. And it's the hands that feel the most sensitive. bath and get a suntan on your face. Mm -hmm. So Huberman, I heard him talking about the ice bath. You should do it 11 hours a week. That means you could do like two six minute ones, or I'm just doing one 10 minute one. So I'm falling short one minute, but I think it's a pretty arbitrary number. <laughs> I mean, you start shivering after like three or four minutes. I don't really see what the extra minute does for you. So I'm sticking with my 10 minutes. I'm starting to shake a little bit. Mm -hmm. I will say it is more, much more pleasant to do it in the sunshine. Um, just feeling the warmth on my face. You can kind of trick yourself into feeling warm and sort of disconnect from your lower body, which is in ice. very beautiful to look at the sun reflecting on the ice cubes. They're like just a bunch of little starbursts. You kind of take your focus off and turn into these shimmering lines. Okay, now we're shivering. I'm guessing I'm at about four minutes. I'm not going to look so often at the clock today. me out of the experience. But I am shaking. I just went to the health club and I did an hour on the elliptical, 
which has got me sweating pretty good. And then I went into the sauna, for the, yeah, the sauna for a half hour. So I was just dripping in sweat. Then I came home and I took a shower because I needed to record a video. And uh, I wanted to get that done first before I did this. And after I get out of this, I'm gonna warm up a little bit and then I gotta edit the video and get it out today. But I definitely wanted to get this done as soon as I could this morning. The worst part of doing this is the fear of doing it. All morning I thought, oh my God, I'm gonna have to go do another one. Do I really need to do another one? Should I do another one? Could I put it off till Monday? You know, all that mental bullshit. But I will tell you that since I started doing this, the Monday through Friday morning cold um, shower, the five minutes at the end of my shower with cold water is much easier. This one I'm doing now is far more intense and makes the five minute cold shower almost something I look forward to because it's so short. It seems so short. My hands feel very numb. They don't hurt as much as last time. My fucking neighbor's got some machine running. Can you hear that? I think it would be much more zen-like if I didn't hear this fucking machine going during my and it wasn't on when I started putting the water in and I put the ice in. Just like a few minutes before I was going to get in, that started. I don't even, I don't know what it is. We don't have anything that makes that much noise here. I'm going to look now to see if I'm halfway. Oh, that's seven minutes already. Oh, is it turning off? Yes. Get my last two minutes and 15 seconds in silence. So I, I make articles and videos for Harry the Rideshare Guy. And I said, I'll tell you what, I'll make a video 10 minutes in my hot tub, in my uh, ice bath, and I'll tell a few stories from the road. I think people would watch that just to see someone in an ice bath for 10 minutes, but I could tell some stories through my shivering. I think it'd make a good video. I haven't gotten the okay for it yet, so we'll see. Ooh, okay, sometimes the shivering just takes over. say right now it's quite pleasant. This uh, process <laughs> is uh, like an initiation ritual because you experience a lot of fear and then you get through it, you push through it, you take action and there's something so liberating about that. And there's also something that's going on with your body that lets you really, once you're past the shock of it, connect with nature, which is actually quite beautiful right now. Okay, I'm, fuck it, I'm going for 11 minutes. Why not? Only one minute more.
The same as last time, 46 it looks like. Mm -hmm. I guess that's a 20 pound bag of ice I poured in. I, I suppose I could put a little less water and get two bags of ice. But again, this really seems to do the job. <laughs> I don't think anyone's gonna say you're slacking. Hmm. Okay, that's 11 minutes. Pretty crazy how fast that went. Hmm. Feel like moving. <laughs> you definitely get numb, and that kills the sensation of being freezing cold. Even though I'm shivering, it's not. Uh, it's not wholly unpleasant. something Wim Hof calls the cold, my little friend, my little warm friend. And this is the first time I've ever, I think I kind of understand what he was talking about. I think too, having the sun on my face um, helps. I wonder if I'd feel different if my head were wet. I don't know. I definitely put my head under the water when I take the cold shower, but it doesn't seem to be any more sensitive than the rest of my body. I don't think that would speed up the shivering. Okay, I'm gonna go for 15 minutes. That's only two more minutes. But just to be clear, 10 minutes is the bare minimum. And if I do that, it's a win. This today is just bonus. Don't know what's gotten into me. <laughs> I could have been out in my warm room with my robe on all dried off at this point. the birds that's really nice I will say the second time is easier than the first you just got to say I'm getting in this fucking thing and, and get into it and uh, Whatever happens, happens, you know? But you won't know until you get in. Okay, I've got 30 seconds to go. And then I'm getting out. <laughs> 